hello guys welcome to this uh, new video this one is a requested question from paper 1 of 2020 this is question 15 so here as you can see we have a region that has been shaded right so it is says it says that this region is defined by three inequalities so we have to find these three inequalities okay so to find the uh, inequalities you must first find the equation of those lines that's the first step you have to know what is the equation of those lines so this one is a vertical line what is this equation this will be x equal to 5 okay and this one is a horizontal line what is this equation that has to be y equal to 3 and for this one we don't know what it is but we can find the equation by using two points on the on the line so let's say I choose this point and I say uh, I choose this point so now I have two points I can find the equation so one point is 0 1 and then I have 6 7 so to find the equation of a line we must first find the gradient m equal to y2 minus y1 over x2 minus x1 so the gradient is equal to 6 over 6 which is 1 so once you have that you can find the equation by using one of the one of the two points so we use this one that will be y minus 1 over x minus 0 is equal to 1 so we just have to cross multiply you will have y minus 1 equal to x so y is equal to x plus 1 so the equation for this line will be y is equal to x plus 1. Now step by step, let's find the inequalities that define that region. So first one, let's begin with this line, this one. As you can see, it is on the left side of this line. Left side means less than 5. That will be less than or equal to 5. That is the first one. Now this one is, it is above this line, so it has to be above y above 3 now finally for this one it is below this line has to be y less than x plus 1 okay so that will be the three inequalities that define this region and that should be your question 15 so I really do think that you will get this question uh, for your paper 1 this year as well it is very common to have those kind of questions so just make sure you understand how to do them step by step. So for step one is to first find the equation of those lines. And step two, we can just see if it is above, below, or on the left or right side of this line. By doing that, you will have your three inequalities that define the region. As always, thank you for watching. I will see you soon.